Hello, Lilas. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, make sure you are a subscriber to this channel. Once you subscribe, you become a Lola. I mean, come on, Lola. <laughs> um, anyway, guys, um, I am here. I am. I don't know about y'all, but I am so sick of Ruby being in every video, every photo. She just, she need to mind her business. Can you move over? Jeez, whiz. Okay, so I wanted to do a kit review. So I'm going to start off just like we do the box openings because that's what we do. So let's see. Let me let me let me see if I can zoom out a little bit. There we go. Ooh, I'm showing the face. If you can't show the face yet, yeah, can't show the face. All right. So this is a leg. Oh my goodness. This is a micro creamy vinyl kit reborn. So remember guys when I said that I am looking for a very specific creamy. Alright. Alright. I think this is what I was looking for but this baby I'll, I'll tell you in a minute. Alright. So that's another leg. <laughs> Let's show you the foot. I'll show you the foot. Hold on. Zoom zoom. Zoom, zoom. Okay, foot, foot, foot. So it's kind of long and flat. Pretty big feet though. <laughs> so I think the good part I will say about the big feet is he or she will wear socks well. Toes. bottom of the foot now wait in my opinion it makes sense the feet being that big on a baby so tiny this baby is 15 inches I think it makes sense because now it does to me anyway because my daughter kept saying, when my grandbabies was born, she kept saying, they have big feet. You know, she kept saying their feet are so big, but I think it's because they have to grow into them. So, hand, hand, long, long, skinny little arms. Okay. Where's, the, where's your other, oh, here's your other arm, okay. Here we are. Come on. Hand. Hand. Beautiful. This, this is, this is. All right, this one even have a tummy plate. Love it, the detail in it in person. I hope it, I don't know if it'll pick up on camera. It's simple, but not simple. You can kind of see a little bit of, there we go. I don't know if you see the, the, the indents of the rib cage. There we go. So detail, but not overly detail. All right, so let's, let's get this position. So we can do the get the head in here. All right. So that would be. All right. So now we got body and the face. Some of you guys already know who it is. Because I told you who I was waiting on. Now she doesn't have eyes, but and I would have put eyes in, but I gotta order eyes for this size. The ones that I thought would work is not going to work. So this is Half Pint by Marita Winters. So she has or he have a little tongue inside. Those puffy eyes like preemies do. This skeleton shape kind of structure face which is how the preemies is when they're born because they're undeveloped 
so everything haven't matured but very cute very super super realistic this is the type of preemie that i was looking for so this is half pint by marina winners and when i saw the prototype that yvonne nathers nathers did i thought to myself oh my god this is amazing really 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 amazing um, I should have bought that prototype when it came up for sec sale on second market but I didn't but I'm gonna do my best to do the kit justice I actually have two I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep both or I'll have one for sale and one to keep <laughs> I can't get it I can't get it uh done <laughs> I can't get it right so it has a little body it did come with a body or I don't know if I if I had to add the body I, I'm not I can't remember um but I suggest getting when kits are this small like this I suggest getting the body that they made for them um because of how little they are I think you know you kind of want to get the right size so this is a very petite little body so super cute She's going to be so super cute. So, I think that the zip ties came in the bag. So, they did come with zip ties. Zip ties were in the bag. But, yeah, so she will be, and I'm saying she, 15 inches. Or it's 15 to 16 inches, but I think it's more 15. Oh, it's just so thinking cute so anyway that would be her I'm not good at this <laughs> I suck at this part but yeah that's 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 gonna be it but very very tiny like literally let me show y'all the leg wait the leg is not much wider <laughs> Than the toothbrush look. So very very petite, really realistic. Cause, but I I I have seen preemies that have been born with weight on them. Um, but usually this young in gestation, which I'm assuming it's got to be around, maybe. I don't know. I have to go look and see what Marita said. I don't want to say anything wrong but yeah and it has the little details in the thighs and stuff so I don't know it's gonna take um definitely more skill to paint something so tiny and that's what I think a lot of people don't understand they're like oh well it's so little why am I paying so much money because it's that much harder to get the details right on a little baby. Um, when I first started painting vinyl, I was so excited about when I painted my first big baby because it was so much easier for me to handle the paint and everything on that bigger baby. So, yeah. So I'm definitely excited about this. Um, like I said, I... I'm working on a lot of different things. Um, my <laughs> look at Ruby. My my um, nursery is going to change totally, completely. I'm I'm actually in the process of remodeling my whole nursery. Um, not entirely, but I'm getting rid of all my baby furniture that's in here. Other than you know, well, not all my baby furniture, but the little chairs and. Stuff like that. I'm sending, you know, high chair to my grandbaby. Um, well, I have a new chair for Cody and, you know, some of the bigger babies like Cody, Maggie. Um, Phoenix might be a little too big for it, but we'll see. I'm going to sit him in there today and see what happens. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna do away with a lot of the swings and rocking chairs, this and that. I'm going to actually... Um, donate them to real children that might need them. Um, my daughter's really good about finding mommies that 
need that type of stuff. And so I'm going to do that um, right after Christmas because I'm going to, the things, the, what I'm going to, what I'm planning on doing is a little project for me. It's going to be, I'm going to have to take my time and, and get it right. But I'm basically going to eliminate all the clutter and it just looks unorganized. There's no real matching system in here. So I want to, um, I want to change that. Um, and I, I don't know exactly um, if I could pull off exactly what I'm trying to do, but I think I can. I'm hoping I can. Um, I'm actually going to try to um, separate my workspace totally as well, like my where that part don't even show. So... Um, going to take a little work but I'm hoping that I can get it done because that's what I want to do I want to I want to find a divider and do that and you know so my workspace is definitely my workspace and then the nursery is the nursery um I will soon hopefully hopefully stop using my changing table as you know workspace because I use my changing table sometimes as workspace and that. Then when I get ready to do videos, it's really kind of complicated because I don't have that space. But I'm, I'm, I can't wait to show you guys. If I could, I would have somebody come pull up this carpet in here, but that would be a whole nother project and I can't do that in the midst of all the orders that I have. So um, that's something on my wish list way down the road. But for now, I have to do what I have to do with the carpet that's in here. Um, and yeah, so anyway, that's that. That's, that's where I'm at. Oh my gosh. I love Ruby. <laughs> oh no, guys. I don't know what it is about her, but I just love her so much. She is like my sweet little baby. She just, I don't know. It's just, <sighs> I can't wait to get her brother worked on. Oh my gosh. It is like driving me insane not to be able to work on him. Um, him and my other Alex, I, oh my gosh, I want to work on Alex too, ever since I worked on this other one, but it's nothing I can do for that right now, but when I finish my orders up, I'm going to take a break from customs and orders, and I don't know, I don't know if I'll, I don't know what's going to happen, I don't, I don't even know what's going to happen, but I know I need time to paint the babies I got, I got so many kits here guys, um, I will probably start putting on my blog, like, as I start painting, which babies will be coming up next for sale. And maybe once I finish, as I, once I finish the painting and stuff, maybe I'll do, like, you can reserve this baby and then I'll have them in rotation for rooting type thing. I think that might work. Um, but yeah, so I got to work out all the details on that part, but that's where I'm at, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and continuing to follow my channel. I appreciate you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed that little mini review. Um, I, I am very curious to see what size diapers this baby is going to wear. Just the whole nine yards. It's just I've never painted a baby this small before. So wish me luck. <laughs> see you later. Bye.